But when you start going back to guard shots, George, the Iceman yeah, Gurgen, come on. Yeah, you got finger yeah. roll. Finger yeah. roll. Yeah. The shot of all guards. Yeah, that about is shots. a signature move. There was one thing that George Gervin did that I still haven't seen anybody in the game do. We were taught, you know, use the back. The backboard is your friend. Everything's yeah. got to be in the square, bank it in the square. George Gervin used all of the glass. He sure did. I mean, he, I, I would huh. watch him practice warming up, mm -hmm. and he would stand, and he would spin it, and it would hit the top of the glass. Yes. And 25, 50 in a row. Yeah, and, 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 <laughs> and trickle and, down. And it's yeah. almost trickle like down. he would spin it up, and you would hear it go, eek. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and it would just come straight back yeah. down. He'd do a right hand, left hand, any part of the glass. I mean, mm -hmm. any part of the glass. He could find a spin or something to, to make it work. Whereas 99.9% .9 of the players playing, we have to put that ball <laughs> right there. in the square <laughs> right. to Touch make the it go in. <laughs> you Ball for the rebound over to Gervin, the Iceman again. Hello. Balls on the outside. Iceman drives for the hoop. Isn't that pretty? Right. And Blue. this may go. It oh. does. Oh. <laughs> Love it. I told George, we, we, we've known each other for so long, and I talked about it. I remember I had gotten, I got hurt in one game. I'm sitting out watching him. He's playing the Golden State. And I swear, I just stood there, and I, I almost wanted to cheer for him. Uh, I mean, okay. he made it look, George made it look so easy. The ice man. All smooth. That is poetry in motion. You talk about how Clyde was smooth and doing his stuff, but not scoring 50 points like this guy did. <laughs> but I love, I mean, I love the game. I mean, and, you know, and I got a lot of my energy from, you know, the history of the game. I mean, I really admired you guys. Um, you know, to, to watch you, you know, perform, you know, on the floor. Um, you know, I didn't have to invent the wheel. All I had to do was take a little piece from greatness. And, you know, I got to thank you guys for inspiring me to become the ball player that I did. I'm going to thank you for a guy at six foot seven playing guard instead of forward so I didn't have to guard you, right, Jack? <laughs> exactly, exactly what I was thinking as you were sitting there. I said, boy, am I glad he was not a forward. We, we used to flip a coin to see who, was, who had to guard him. We did. I was let Van Leer try to guard him. I was glad he didn't. But yeah. Look. They call him the Iceman, Mr. Cool. I did everything George did. I wore my socks. I tried to get his numbers wherever I could and, and just to be like George. Smitty, the clutch and go, oh. he floats it in. Nice finger roll like his idol, George Gervin. And one of my favorite things to do at All-Star is hang out with the legends. But now I'm getting to hang out with the legends of all legends from the east side of Detroit. Uh, 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 uh. But you know what I wanted to know that I didn't know? Who gave you the name Iceman? Fatty Taylor. Went to Virginia and, and, and played with the Virginia squad. And Fatty Taylor, you know, was like the captain. And Dr. J was on that team also. And I used to go to work, man. And, you know, after we finished, I didn't sweat. And he just couldn't believe it, man. I mean, and he always just said, man, wow, man, you you ice cold, man. I mean, you know, and they was just getting to know me. I, I'm probably one of the only guys, man, in the history of basketball, man, um, that shot for his contract, you know, because I was playing with the Pontiac Chaparrales, and I was driving 38, and Johnny Red Kerr saw me, and Johnny Red Kerr knew Earl Foreman, and he called Earl Foreman, who was the owner of the Virginia Squires, and he said, you need to take a look at this kid, and they flew me in and they say, shoot. And shoot. I made 25 out of 33s and they say, you hired, so. <laughs> Mount Rushmore of scores. Ice, you're on there for sure. I got one originals and. Wow. Ice, I would love for you to sign that for me. Man, that would sure be nice, dude. <laughs> Love you, Ice. Love you, man. 1980 scoring champ, George Gervin. Everybody know Ice Man, baby, if you know George Gervin. You know what I mean? Kids, like, you know, I go and say, I'm George Gervin. They say, who? What do you? I say, Ice Man. <laughs> George Gervin, the Ice Man. George Gervin was so far ahead of his time. It was unbelievable. This guy stands out there and he shoots, you know, three point shots like they're layups. And he shoots layups differently than anybody else. Check that shot out. The <laughs> ultimate finger roll. One thing that I could do is finger roll. Finger roll. Finger roll. And the Iceman, what a play. I just think that was just a great shot for me. 
So Charlie couldn't nobody block it. You know, he just rolled it over their fingertips, you know, and they think they got it and it just rolled over. I know the Iceman poster. I had that poster. Silver sweatsuit, ball, on, you know, on each hand. Sitting on the block of ice with his legs crossed. Best poster ever. I entertain people. They knew when uh, they came to see ice, you know, they were going to at least do this one time. Oh, good shot. <laughs> ice was uh, real cool. That's what he was. Smooth on the basketball court, and, uh, was good under pressure. So I think that big name was great. I didn't sweat much at that time, you know, I thought I was 160 pounds, so I really had a much more in to sweat. So that's how I really got my nickname. You know, Fatty Rolling Taylor and Julius Irvin started calling me Ice. I'm Ice now. <laughs> I had a shot for all the cases. Like he could finger roll from almost anywhere from 15 feet in there. He could just flip that thing and just real soft. We wanted to have some fun. It was after practice, we standing around, just uh, messing around. The ice man would be behind the basket, flipping things up, uh, finger rolls from, from the corner behind the basket, which uh, the, guy was, the guy was amazing. You know, I just think that was just a great shot. It's hard to get nobody blocked it. You know, you just roll it over their fingertips, you know, and they think they got it and it just roll over. I ain't think nobody can stop me. I go back to Detroit and believe it or not, the guy that I was playing with in high school is still playing. The these guys followed me my whole career. Now my career's over, now they can't come on back in the city. And we got something for you. And I'm saying, like, Oh, you don't. Not no industrial ball player. You ain't got that thing. The game is still alive. You know, I can still play. They just won't pay me. <laughs> So that's it for this video guys, I want to thank you guys so much for watching. If you did enjoy, make sure you guys smash a like button, let's see if we can hit 100 likes. And also subscribe to the channel to catch all the new content. We will be releasing daily videos for all of 2022, like I said. And also make sure to let me know down in the comments below what you thought. I will be responding to all the comments. Thank you guys so much for watching, and have a great day.